My name is Jennifer. I'm here today because ME has affected my family for generations. My grandmother, my father, my sister all died. My brother is severely ill on his deathbed right now. His only child died. I became ill over 10 years ago. I went from being a very motivated, active, excited person about life to being completely bedridden and fighting to stay alive every second of every day while in absolute torture. I saw doctor after doctor and specialist after specialist more tests than I could name or list. Um, it took several years for me to get a diagnosis of ME and I was the first person in my family to get it. Um, for years, we thought that we had an orphan disease that only existed within our family because we, there was no information about this disease and no doctor could recognize it or uh, do anything to help. Um, some of them would say, I'm sorry, this is obviously really complex, but I don't know what it is. I liked those doctors because at least they acknowledged that they didn't know. Many others would say, since I don't recognize it, it must not be real and it's in your head. So you should seek therapy. That's what they told my dad before he died. Um, that's what they've been telling my brother, who's dying. They told me that. Um, I was pretty much totally bed bound for the first six years. Then I moved to a place with less air pollution and lower elevation. My quality of life was raised by a couple of degrees. I'm now about 85% housebound. I can do a little more than I used to, but I still spend the majority of my time feeling pretty horrible in bed and wishing that I could be around for my children who want me, more of me than I'm able to give, and go about fulfilling all of the goals and dreams that I had, that I was on the path to fulfilling 10 years ago when it all just ended. We need more funding for research. My children need for me to stay alive. And since they obviously have the genes for this, if and when they get it, there needs to be treatment options for them.